A record reaction. <laughs> I need to stop doing that shit. I don't know if people like it or not, but yeah. This time we're doing a reaction to should we bring back extinct animals? I don't know. Like, I, I guess ex animals that are extinct, like, recently, but not animals that are, like, extinct. Like, over a thousand years, i say. Over, like, 500, 500 years. Other than that, don't bring them back. Because there's no point. Like, everything changed. We changed, like, the planet to, like, the extreme. Oxygen, it's more carbon dioxide, all that. It's like poison, I guess. Huh. Less trees, obviously. We just assholes to the environment. We, we really, really don't care. But dinosaurs, I guess the small ones, or like the plant eaters, not, not the carnivores, because if they get out. Yeah, if it was on an island, I guess so you can do it, but. Re re regular no but yeah this video is linked in the description if you watch that without me talking over it and this is your boy a rug reaction the video is about to start welcome to life noggin this said that a little early but yeah news and bad news the bad news is that a bunch of really cool animals are currently extinct yeah. dinosaurs woolly mammoths saber-toothed tigers Whoa. and my personal favorite the carolina parakeet look how adorable this thing is <laughs> parakeet why is it may be able to bring some of these animals back from extinction but whether or not we should is up for debate so how is that even possible in the first place? what's extinct well unfortunately for any jurassic park fans that tasmanian tiger aren't going to be brought back tasmanian tiger yeah, yeah, it'd be hard for them. Animals like the passenger pigeon that lived yeah. in the 19th century will be resurrected. And that's because in order to bring these animals back, scientists need bits of their yeah, genetic Yeah, I think that's like the most abundant bird sadly, in North America. Yeah, dinosaurs have survived millions of them, billions of them, that's and we just destroyed it all. To ride a eating them. Raptor. But for the animals that's what, that's that can what I be resurrected, they'll be more like hybrids yeah. than actual clones. See, the passenger pigeon that scientists are trying to bring back won't be exact copies of the originals. Instead, scientists would need to create a hybrid bird yeah, using yeah, the passenger yeah. pigeon's closest living relative, what? like the band-tailed pigeon. Simply put, this would work Keep by mixing them, fusing them, fusing them. Genome so that it has a few traits of the passenger pigeon. Essentially, the scientist would create a cell that is mostly band-tailed pigeon, but also a little bit passenger pigeon. And eventually, that's hybrid until I guess he can breed with passengers. And eventually, an animal. So we'd end up with passenger pigeon 2.0. Not that it would thing, be that hard. I don't possible. think it would be that hard to do birds. Also be done with elephants. Elephants. Of bringing yeah. back the woolly mammoth. It's no point of woolly mammoth. It'd be too hot. issues. Like, should we even? Try to Polar bears are having a hard time. You think a woolly the map, hope is woolly that if any of these extinct animals could be brought back, they'd eventually be reintroduced into their natural habitat. But for a lot of these animals, that natural habitat no longer exists. What the passenger pigeon used to call home has now been replaced with houses, malls, and highways. And yeah. even more, resurrecting extinct animals might take resources and attention away from programs that would prevent even more species yeah, from going Yeah, that's true, too. So. But and perhaps the most looking, interesting question is what we would even human hunger. Animals. Unless you go feed pets, no. I don't understand. But what would we call them as they begin to look and people, act more like uh, the original species? In other words, <laughs> would that be enough to say that the species is really back, or just that humans have created a really convincing replica? What do you? Unless think? you want to go to Mars. Below. And like, One animal that we definitely don't want to lose is cats. But what cats. Would happen <laughs> if they all went extinct tomorrow? All right. What I was about to say was that uh, if we like travel to a different planet, we can uh, like start extinct animals on there instead of our planet because our planet is like limited on resources now since we've been using so much of it and like scarring the planet but yeah that's what i think the original video is linked in the description if you don't watch that without me talking over it this is your boy we're gonna reaction i had to clear my throat don't judge me man but yeah it's your boy we're gonna reaction i'm a god